So shout out to SKC because he actually is the one that was playing this. And of course, I said, we got to take a look at it. So let's see what's going on with the kids. All right. Shout out to Gremlins. Where did you get the gun? On March 10th, 2023, a Vero Beach High School teacher received a handwritten note concerning an 18-year-old sophomore student who was bragging about having a loaded gun in the classroom. Pause. Pause. Now listen. <laughs> oh, child, listen. <laughs> It's not funny. It's not funny. It's not funny. Okay. But it says an 18 year old sophomore. Okay. We already. <laughs> That's a problem right there. But listen to each his MF and O to each his MF and O child. He shouldn't even have been in school. He should have been in a, um, what is it called? Night school or something. Night school, after school program, child. I don't know, but what we not, what I'm not gonna have is an 18 year old in the same grade as basically my 15 year old, cause you're a dummy. Student who was bragging about having a loaded gun in the classroom. The teacher immediately notified the on campus deputy, who eventually called for backup. Where, where is the backpack supposedly? In here. Seven two nineteen. I go back door, you go back. During the investigation, it was noted that the student also bragged about having bigger guns in her backpack. Well, I guess we should be thankful for uh, people who don't know how to keep things to themselves so that this, God forbid, if it was going to turn in any, into anything, did not turn into anything. The principal, along with a deputy, surrounded the classroom to retrieve the student. Okay. Yeah, well, we're close. Yeah, we're closer to admin than we are in the house. Okay, I just want to ask you a few questions. I didn't want to go to the I got a little tip. Well, I have one time that I need for the member of my room, you're telling me there are one woman. That's an SR. Okay, that's what he said. So that's not your good. Yesterday, remember when I was in there checking bags in your math class? Well, today, it was reported that you had hidden a backpack. This is what I'm being told. Look, the policeman is right in the back where he belongs. <laughs> right, just in case that person, child, I, don't, I think it's a girl, decides that they want to whip the bag out and, you know, do something crazy, okay? The police will be in the shout, shout out to the oppressor, okay? Shout out to the oppressor. And honestly, shout out to the principal who's like all calm and everything. I can't imagine. It's not for me. I can't do it. I can't do it. Because the principal was like, well, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. That's what, yeah, I'm just saying that's what people were saying. Yeah, you can so, show my bag. Yeah, and that's how I don't want to do it in the classroom. So, honestly, yeah. you know, we got to do what we got to do, okay? Yeah. Come on. In here. Please. Now, let me ask you before you go any further on that. Did you, do you recall, did you ever make a statement like that yesterday that maybe someone... You were messing around and somebody said they saw it or heard it? They ain't never seen it or heard it. Okay. Can I see your backpack? Yeah. <laughs> you have anything else on you that you shouldn't have on you today? Could you empty your pocket? I can't wait to hear what the mama got to say. <laughs> oh, actually, this person is 18 years old, actually. So I guess there ain't no need for the mama. Shout out to Almond Eyes. Thank you so much for the support. She says, wait, 18-year-old sophomore, what the F? <laughs> Child, girl, girl, girl. Girl. This is what I'm talking about. That's the problem right there. And this hair, okay? But, you know, you can't say anything because, you know, there's the Crown Act now. And you can wear your hair any old way that you want to. So, you can have oomph oomph hair. Shout out to Quan down in Fulton County. You can have a thing straight up on your head like a tree stump like J-Damn-Z. Because that's supposed to be the culture now, y'all. That's the culture. And you can't say anything because that means you're racist. If you say anything about somebody's hair, that's a racist. You can't talk about black people. That's racist. You don't know.
Ooh, give me a second, y'all. My man. I'm with my rounds. I put your pink, my booty whole brown. What a nigga, I'm looking for the hoes. Quit playing nigga, come suck a bitch toes. Pound town, just left pound town. Put your pink, my booty whole brown. What a nigga, I'm looking for the hoes. Quit playing nigga. Just to let you niggas know, we don't need y'all. We want y'all, but we don't need you. 20 years later. Our black men, we want all y'all back. Because we love you, we see you, kings. And most importantly, we need you. And most importantly, we need you. And most importantly, we need you. Definitely need some men for this child right here, 18 years old and in uh, the 10th damn grade. Mark, it's out for a minute. Because I'm checking for the safety. I'm checking everything. Everything. Then empty your pockets. Huh? I don't feel like you. Empty your pockets or you're going to be Okay, listen. Uh, I smell weed, but that. I, I was not. Good. I'm, listen, I'm just explaining okay. to you that I'm doing a safety check. No one's accused you of anything. Why search me, though? We have a serious I allegation. So we are going to search you. Okay, but can you call me home? I don't feel this is necessary. Oh. oh. Can you call my mom? Can you call my mama over here? I want you to call my mama. I'm over here with the weed smell. I'm 18 years old and I'm a sophomore. And allegedly, I might have a GUN. But call my mama, please. Call my mama. It was other kids in the classroom. I know. I was know, I don't Stand know. up. Stand but up. Wait, wait, why? Because I'm telling you to. Stand up. Stand up. Yeah, you're not under arrest. You understand that? No, sir. I don't feel this is necessary to search me, though. Oh, it's not necessarily it's not necessary to search this person, though, child. I'm not really sure, child. I'm sorry, because this is racist. What is The racism that you're experiencing and the struggle to make ends meet actually means the diet don't work for you the same. Oh, I, 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 I can't hear you, hon. You got a what? Oh, now we got to go to the bathroom. Probably some shakedown on the bottom of this. But... That's Man, this lady's bro. serious. Oh, this pressure is serious. Don't be upset with me. I'm not upset with you. But why are y'all searching? I told you why. Oh, my God. Go ahead. Resource to you. He said, I told you why. <laughs> you get <laughs> You better listen. We all know how this is going to end. Where the wait lady at from the, um, from the CVS from yesterday? Oh, my God. How dare you call the police? How dare you call the police when all you did was hear some say something about a black person how dare you call the police you should leave me alone you're racist you're racist you're racist everybody racist yeah nothing on it okay i'm gonna step out for a second i'm gonna step out okay come on come on come on come on come on bleeders oh my god bruh Oh, oh, oh. So that's why you go and search my book bag. Go and search my book bag. It's all good. Because it's in my pocket. So that's where the, oh, why you got to search me? Call my mama. Call my mama. 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 Oh, my God. Child, what in the actual F? Oh, bitch. Another one? That's my wallet. Man. Oh, man. Research, 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 research. Just go ahead and tell them signal zero. We're by Yankee. 
Ain't nothing on me, bro. That's the search. We got what we needed. Uh, is this necessary? Yes, ma'am. Yes. I don't have nothing else on me. I swear I don't. Just cooperate. But I am cooperating. Oh my God, bro, you're serious. Sit down. I'm going to step out back with Mr. O'Keefe just for a second. I didn't want to hear this. You're in possession of a firearm on some I understand that. I understand that. But no one was harmed. The tip was received. It doesn't matter if anybody's harmed. OMG. You can't tell these odds anything. You gotta wait till someone is on before you say anything to me. It's not racist. This is racist. Now listen, the sophomore didn't say it, child. I don't know what it is. The sophomore didn't say it. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure somebody might probably gonna say racist. The racism that you're experiencing and the struggle to make ends meet actually means the diet don't work for you the same. Use your common sense. Wow. Mm -mm -mm. How dare they do something about this when nothing even happens? So in other words, we should wait until something happens and someone gets hurt and then come and find this person. Because like at Morgan State, you got the free still of the three people and nobody seems to know where they are. They haven't caught them. It's been a week. Or over here, they do have the dude from Brooklyn, but he was out there for a couple of days. And now you got the daggone girlfriend saying, I'm not going to help you oppress her. I'm not going to help you oppress her. You figure it out for yourself because I do not like the police. I do not like the police. I do not like the police. Where Black Lives Where, Where Dr. Umar? Dr. Umar, where you at? Dr. Umar, where you at? What you got to say about this? I want to know. Probably that the oppressor is mishandling the, the sophomore, okay? I can hear it now, child. You're not allowed to possess a firearm, period. Let alone on school grounds. Where your license? Where your license for that? Where you can feel carry for that. Okay, I'm going to read you your Miranda. Read it. Okay. Read it. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say, Cannon. Huh? I'm not going to okay. Yes. Right now, listen. you listen to your rights. Okay. I want you to tell me whether you understand them or not. Okay. You have the right to remain silent. Okay. Anything you say, Cannon, will be used against really? you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have your lawyer present with you while you are being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before questioning. If you decide to answer... That's probably her mama calling. I'm sorry, the sophomore's mama calling, child. Don't want to misgender nobody. The sophomore's mama calling right now. She knows something is going on with her baby. <laughs> Answer questions now without a lawyer present. You still have the right to stop answering at any time and speak with a lawyer. Ahead, you may use any of these rights at any time during the interview. Do you understand the rights that I've just read to you? Okay. Do you want to answer questions? Yes. Okay, what are you doing with... Oh. 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 Answer the questions without a lawyer. Come on, sophomore. Oh, well, you are 18 year old sophomore, so maybe you don't know. But, child, you know damn well you're not supposed to talk to no daggone police without a lawyer damn present, especially when you're black, because we already know that everybody is against us. Everyone is racist, okay? Shout out to my girl, Aminaz. Thank you so much for the support. She said this a whole stud. <laughs> she said this a whole stud. All right, I'm not going to call stud. I'm just going to call sophomore. But I hear you. I hear you, child. I hear you. <laughs> I want to know if that really is the mama call. Whose phone is ringing? Whose phone is ringing? Oppressor? Is that your phone? Whose phone is ringing? Shout out to my guy, Jeff Johns, in the building. Thank you so much for the support. Appreciate you. He says, felony firearm charge, three years, unless woke unless a woke judge throws it out. That's probably exactly what's going to happen, unfortunately, because we see so many woke people in all these stories. It'll be the daggone woman who was in the CVS. She probably the judge. She's going to come through and say, you don't know. You don't know they had a tough life. Slavery has affected them. Oh, my God. 
white supremacy, discrimination, and racism. Child, thank you so I much. Guess, what the what? What a money reside. What a money reside. What a money reside. What a money reside. And that's all who? Man had a little lamb. Okay. 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 Hit the like button, y'all. Thank you so much. It's a handgun on school crowns. Yeah, I honestly was not trying on anybody. I was just carrying Why were you carrying it around on school grounds? Because I understand that there's people on school ground that likes to bully people. And I felt like I was being bullied. Oh, now we being bullied. Who bullying you, sophomore? Who bullying the sophomore? Who's bullying this young scholar? Who? 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 You could just take the homeschooling classes so you could graduate, child. You shouldn't even be in here. What is the daggone um age limit where it's like you can't come back here after certain age limits? I really feel like that's too daggone old to be in the daggone tenth damn grade. <laughs> Okay. Did you tell your advisor that you was having problems with bullying child? I'm pretty sure ain't nobody bullying you. I could be wrong. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. Everything is alleged over here. Okay. Where did you get the gun? Where? I got it from off the street. Where did you get the gun? Mm. Um, where did I get the gun? Did you steal it from? No, did you acquire it from somebody else? No, so how did you get it? He's laying on the ground. Yes. How long have you had the gun? How many times have you brought it to school? Of course, this is the first time. Of course, this is the first time. You've been bullied, and this is the first time that you decided to bring it to school, and then you got caught on the first time? Of course, that's what happened. Child, we believe you. Sophomore, we do believe you, young scholar. Today's the first? Yes, I swear. Yesterday. I didn't bring no gun yesterday, what I swear. But, uh, okay, well, I heard a statement that you brought it yesterday. Caltech 380 semi-automatic. Is there something in it? Yes. It's loaded. It's loaded. I'm sorry, oh. no, it's not a... No. Yes, sir, okay, it's a Ruger. Not a Caltech. It looks just like a Caltech. <laughs> No gun yesterday, I swear. But, uh, okay, well, I heard a statement that you brought it. I said, uh, Caltech 380 semi automatic. Is there something in it? Yes. It's loaded. It's loaded. I'm sorry, no, it's not a. No. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, sir, okay, it's a Ruger. Not a Caltech. It looks just like a Caltech. Sean? It's loaded. Mm. It was. It has a magazine with bullets, and there was one in the chamber. It's going to be a transport. Oh, yes, no. no! No, 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 What's Young Jock songs going down? Hey, it's going down. You got one in the chamber. You got it loaded. You got it on school grounds. You got it in your pocket. You lied. Somebody going down. Where mama at? Where the good mama? Where the mama at? Is that the mama calling with a mama at? I'm sure this is racist, though. Racist? You're being racist toward my baby. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. Shout out to Jeff Johns for another five. Thank you so much, hon. He says, diarrhea in the mouth, also known as self-snitching. We like that around here. <laughs> we like that around probably gonna get out like somebody said with a woke judge i said we can't do this to the black youths we can't do this to the black youths it's not right it's not fair oh my god racism white supremacy and discrimination jim crow red line and systemic racism slavery all them things cause this 18 year old who's in the 10th grade to do this it's not right it's not fair you need to right the wrongs of the past and let the sophomore go free. I'm just can I, can I make a phone call? Not, not right yet. Now. You can make a phone call when you get to the Cameron County Jail. The County Jail? Yes. Are you serious? Yes. Well, you said, I'm going to talk to you because I'm your administrator. I'm, 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 I'm like your parents today. Here's why I want to tell you why. There, you have something. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go back from your office. office. So it's very serious nature. So they're gonna they're gonna have to do this until it gets worked out. Are you serious? No, 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 no. You're you, walking around so, in school with a gun with bullets in it. 
Nobody was hurt. No, that's not what the sophomore said, but that's what I'm going to say. Nobody was hurt, though. Nothing happened. It's okay. It's not a problem. Now it sounds like we're getting a, a, a quaky voice. Everybody all bust a big badass until it's time to be bust a badass. And now it's, oh, my God. How could you do this to me? Voice becoming a little shaky now. It's not a big deal. I ain't do nothing. Ain't nobody get hurt. What's the problem? What's the problem? Might be some racism coming up. Shout out to Victim Ryan in the building. <laughs> Thank you so much for the support. I appreciate you, honey. He says, what? Supremacy, bigotry, and racism. Say it with me. What? Supremacy, bigotry, and racism. Dr. Umar! What you got to say about this, Dr. Umar? Where Black Lives Matter? This Black Life Matters. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where they 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 at? Just asking. Yeah, but no one was hurt, sir. So I don't care. It is a felony to have a weapon on school grounds. Oh. Plus, you were a juvenile. Or did you turn 18? I'm 18. You're 18 now? Oh. Okay, so you're going to the county jail. Okay. What a difference one year makes. <laughs> What a difference one year makes. Okay, yes, yes, yes. You are an adult. There's no calling mama, even though they, they don't need mamas anyway. They just let them out. They just let them out. Depending on where you are, I don't know where this is. Uh, Vero Beach. So is this California? Oh, they definitely getting out then. Vero Beach is in California. Somebody let me know, I believe. They definitely getting out. Mm-hmm. There'll be a woke judge that'll be like, oh, this poor baby, this poor baby didn't know. It's not his, it's not the sophomore's fault. It's not the sophomore's fault. Oh my God. Where'd that other comment go? Hold on. It's white supremacy, bigotry, and racism. It's white supremacy, bigotry, and racism. We're going to let him, we're going to let the sophomore go. Going back to school, child. Going back to school. Get your education. Graduate in the next four years. And then come back and see us and we'll give you a job. I can hear it now. <laughs> Shout out to John Bill Bay in the building. Thank you so much for the support, honey. He said, I'm mixed and wife is Puerto Rican. Puerto Rico, ho! Puerto Rico, ho! Can't wait to go back. Thank you so much. Appreciate you and your wife. Thank you for being here. Shout out to John again. He said, I get called racist, bigot, and MSG. Of course you do. So do I. Welcome to the club. Welcome to the club. I am a white supremacist. Pick me, mammy. Uh, uh, small penis. Don't like black women. All this crap, child. It's a whole list. I need to write it down. It's a whole list. Shout out to Shanika. She said it's Florida. Shout out. <laughs> One of my favorite states. Thank you so much, Shanika. So it's Florida. Okay. Shout out to Florida doing the damn thing. Okay. So actually, the the complete opposite. She gonna have the sophomore gonna have a problem. The sophomore gonna have a problem in Florida because Ron ain't having it. Okay. They do not play down in Florida. Shout out to the NAACP. Maybe they can help her. NAACP. Hey, NAACP. This Negro here is going to have some problems. Come help the colors. Come on, NAACP. Come on. You can go over there and say, how come you didn't leave the state? Because black people are not supposed to be in Florida. Black people are not supposed to visit Florida. Black people are not supposed to patronize Florida. They are not for the colors. You need to leave Florida. <laughs> Maybe the good mama will call the NAACP for... Or sophomore. Are you serious? Yes. I can't even call. Can you call my mom for me? We will call her. Well, you could call her from the jail. Oh, man. <laughs> I, was, I, was, I was just in the office and I was on probation. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Turn 18. I'm 18. You're 18 now? Okay. So you're going to the county jail. Okay. Are you serious? Yes. I can't even call. Can you call my mom for me? We will call her. Well, you could call her from the jail. 
I was I was, I was just finna get off juvenile probation. I was just fitting to get off a of juvenile probation. You can't, you can't, you cannot make this shit up. <laughs> That's what I thought I heard. You was just fitting to get off a of probation. Are you stupid or something? I'm as stupid as a stupid noise. Mm, mm, mm. This pretty stupid. This pretty stupid child. This is one time thing. I never bought it yesterday. I swear, I, I never bought it yesterday. You may not have. I just we just got a tip, and I told you when I got you out of the classroom, I have to look at all tips, yeah. whether it's weapons, guns, whatever it is, weed. I didn't bring no weed. Okay, well it smelled of it. That's all. Yeah. And uh, but when we ask them your pocket, you you know if you refuse, this is what happens. So if I would empty my pockets, y'all would never did this to me. No, we well, you still would have been arrested. <laughs> but you don't have to go through all the anguish. Just you know that when you're in my office with deputies and you know you have something, it's best just to, it's not going to get any better. I want to know. I just want to know what's going on. So just like I told you, you're going to go to the county jail. Okay, you're under arrest right now for possession of a weapon on school grounds. Hmm. It's a felony. Felony. Okay. So you will, we're getting a transport unit here. You're gonna- I don't think you're going back to class, sophomore. <laughs> oh, Lord, 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 help the people. Lord, help the people. Shout out to Shanghai 22 in the building. Thank you so much for the support. <laughs> Everybody, please hit the like button. Subscribe if you are new. They said, really, the sophomore got caught with a strap. The 18-year-old sophomore. Let's we not forget that part. The 18-year-old sophomore. That's why I said, ain't no going back to class now, child. So you was already on juvenile probation, so you can't even act like you didn't know what the rules are, okay? Mm, mm, mm. Woo! Interesting. Real-life reality. You're going to be transported to the county jail. Okay? At that time, you will be able to use the phone. And book yeah, Mr. Branch. to call whoever you'd like. Mr. Branch, you can just call me for me? No, ma'am. No. No, you do it. Yeah. Who do you live with? Just curious. I still have one. Your mother? Yeah. Does she know you got one? No. I mean, you're 18? Yeah. She's 18. I think we'll eventually, on my end, contact your mother. I Can you please? I mean, I so she knows, to. please? Well, that's what? all. Oh, now is please. With a little bit of quiver, please. Please get my mama on the line. What about getting the Lord on the line? Lord, 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 help the people. Lord, help the people. I don't even know what to tell this young scholar child i'm trying i'm trying to be mindful child i'm trying to be mindful of this young scholar child Woo! good luck to this child though come on this police this police lady is not playing no games this police woman is like i do not care this police woman is straight up i do not give a damn i'm here to tell you right now we don't care let me tell you, <laughs> let me tell you we don't care Jerry. law enforcement right now she will know when you contact her at the jail. Yeah, you're okay, under right, control right now. Right now, you are 18. Okay, you're an adult at this point. So we don't have to follow the same things that we would with a juvenile. Okay, so when you get to the county jail, you can call mom. You're oh, going to have to wait. So yeah, so it's in her bag. It's in her bag. Earbuds are in her bag. This is in her bag. It's a lip gloss, mm-hmm. I think. What about- Yo, you know what else? These police are like, her, 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 her. They said, F all that, what your pronouns are. They said, her, her, ha, 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 ha. You don't see the sophomore saying nothing about nothing either. About your jacket. Do you want to keep that on or you? Yeah. Do you have any other jewelry on? What about your belt? Yeah, too. Alicia, are you in fear of anything? Oh, just, you're going to jail. I, I mean, is there anybody about at school that you're worried about? I mean, yeah, it was. Name her. I don't know. I don't know. Um, nice belt. My Apple Watch, please. Um, kids was trying to like they was messing with me and my sister, and I 
Did you report it to anybody yet? Yeah, she had my sister report it to any time. Good. Miss Bull, we came to Miss Bull about it plenty of times. Yeah. It was um, a couple of girls, but. Well, we'll get. Right now, we just want to make sure that we're doing everything that we can. And, and now, were you worried that the these girls were going to attack you with weapons? Yeah, they always seeing how they're going to do this to me and my sister, and I just. The suspect was charged with three serious felonies, including possession of a weapon on school grounds. The mother of the suspect argued that her daughter was innocent and claimed that the officers had not properly executed their duties. Ah, child, we already knew it, okay? It never effing fails, and you know what's coming after that, child. The racism that you're experiencing and the struggle to make ends meet actually means the diet don't work for you the same. Damn, damn, damn. <laughs> oh, child. You cannot make this ish up. You knew the good mama was coming through. Not my baby. Not my, you did wrong. It was you. You did wrong. Oh my God! Is that right? Is that fair? Where the white people at? Where the white people at? Where the white social justice people at? Come get my baby! I mean, your baby was already on juvenile probation. Your baby came over here with a weapon in school. Your baby smelled like weed, according to the daggone uh the uh uh principal. Okay, she had it. Let me rephrase. The sophomore had it loaded with one in the chamber, but it's everybody else that's the problem. 18 years old in 10th grade, that already introduced a lot. But, you know, some of you, not y'all, but social justice person will come through with some sad ass whatever, whatever, whatever. Luckily, this is in Florida. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and believe that they're not going to play no games. And this person will be uh, sentenced to a little bit of time. Okay. Hopefully, the sophomore will learn a lesson, go to night school, and turn her life around. And don't be listening to your mama because that's most of the time where y'all be failed at. Yo, mamas. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for your luck. Sorry for your luck. Shout out to Jeff Johns for another two. Thank you so much, honey. Said, here comes the social justice finesse. Absolutely. That's absolutely what's about to happen. Like I said, just like the lady in the daggone uh, CVS. You should have called police on those black men. How dare you call the police on those black men stealing? You should just let them steal. You don't know. You don't know what they've been through. That's racist with your little $30,000 job. I'm cutting for the criminals while you're over here working your $30,000 job. My name is Karen and I know what I'm talking about. You should let these black people steal. Let the blacks steal. Ooh, child, you can't make it up. Let me go ahead and use this as We do not care. 